Well, I just found the biggest deer horn I've ever found to date. Um, I haven't walked up on it, but I can tell you right now it's the biggest frame buck I've ever found. Hi, I'm Hunter Larson, and you're watching the Smoke Channel. Alright, here we are. We're looking for deer sheds. We have none right now, but in five minutes we will. <laughs> uh, yeah, alright. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> Good night. Alright, well, <clears throat> I've been hiking for probably 20 minutes now, and my dad took went to the right and I went left, and there's signs not in here this year like it usually is, just because the, the weather's been kind of bad. We've had a lot of moisture, which is good for this next hunting season, but... There's not very much sign in here, so we were going to pack up and go a little lower. As I was circling down toward the truck, I got a horn spotted right here. Just a little three-point horn, but I'm glad to be picking at least a horn up today. Well, that's what it took to get here. Hopefully it's worth it. We have our insurance policy in the back. We got one horn. Well, we've been hiking in this spot for about 20 minutes or so. It's a muddy mess. We're sinking to our ankles in mud, but my dad just got on the radio and said that he just found a little brown horn, so we're gonna go see what the brown horn is. And I'm somewhat out here in the open when you get to this. Both sides are the same as far as color on this horn, I mean. Yeah, it's this year. Really light one. Yeah, it just looks like it's been on the ground for six months, I guess. Well, we got three horns, they're all babies. Oh, look at that one. There it is. Yeah. It's the other side. It's the other side, and it's the same buck, but it's. From last year. We found these two horns and then when I was picking these up, I seen like 20 deer up here, a great big four point, had both sides, and they ran down that way. And then I came up here and I found this one, so there must have been another buck in there because I'm pretty sure that he just dropped that. Yeah, there's tracks right here from where they've been running you can see in the mud where they've been running yeah look how bloody that base is and it's wet very good just finally got back into a little bit more sign i got a set right here just a little little set but let's go see if it's brown or if it's uh white Kind of looks like it's white, but that's a little three point set right there. There's one there, and the other one's right there. Well, I just found the biggest deer horn I've ever found to date. Um, I haven't walked up on it, but I can tell you right now it's the biggest frame buck I've ever found. Here we go. Yeah. Holy shit, Dad. Holy shit. You need I okay, I have to have you come up here. I gotta find you and you gotta help me find the other side of this thing. This thing is giant. Kinda speechless right now. Look at that thing. I have never found a horn that big. Ever. That is the very biggest horn. I have ever found. That is insane. That thing is crazy. <laughs> that is a giant deer right there. Holy crap. Deer horns don't really get me excited, but this one has got me so excited. I'm gonna search this whole area left and right. Oh my heck. Now that is why I do this.
All right, I think I found the other side of this big old buck. Oh, I hope it is the other side. No way, it's not that deer, it's not the same deer. It's another four point with a cheater. <laughs> I'm after the big boy. That's a decent shed, but that's not the one I'm after. This is horn number four since I've been looking for this other side of this big shed. I hope I can stumble onto this big shed, but anyways, it's not a bad horn. It's been sitting there for a while, but not a bad horn. Must have hit the honey hole or something, but got another horn spotted. Let's hope that it's the big one. I can already tell you it's not the big one, but it's a good four point and it might be the other side to this one here. Nope, it's the same side horn, son of a bee. <laughs> oh. Anyways, we're still hunting for that horn. We're at horn number nine since I've been trying to find that uh, big side of that deer. And I've got another one, but this is what I'm contending with. This is how deep every step I'm really having to earn. <laughs> I'm really having to earn these horns, um, but it's well worth it. All these, like I've never walked just in the mountains where there's just been so much mud. Anyways, there's another little horn there. Oh, I'm gonna have to come back up in here next week or so and see if I can't match that big one up.